No! <laughs> oh my god. Hey guys, we're time six back watching Money Heist Part 5, Episode 5, the first half of Season 5, called Live Many Lives. If you enjoy our videos, make sure to leave a like, comment down below your thoughts, and if you're new to the channel, make sure to subscribe for when the second half comes out. We will be reacting to that on the channel. You also still get the full reactions over on our Patreon page. Link is down below. Help support the channel, and let's get started right away. This is an old Audi. So it was a flashback. Oh! The original heist. Oh. How did she get knock, knock a shot? Because she's going to shoot him. Oh. Oh, Dude. dang. Oh, shit. You got to run. <laughs> oh, this is when they recruited her. Tenemos que encontrarla. Este es el talento que necesitamos. El ariete. Mujer es una superviviente. <laughs> y ahora también es una asesina. Well, you didn't want killers. Una <laughs> chapuza. He's critiquing the... <laughs> yeah. <laughs> the amateurs. <laughs> leave... Yeah, leave him from the front door. Come on. Oh my god. <laughs> he meant <laughs> Ooh. Okay, that would work. Oh, wow. Shoot her. Chicken. With a bomb with inside? <laughs> Fucking genius. Oh, there's nothing in there. Oh. There's wow. nothing. Oh, is there it? is. <laughs> he is a psycho. What I was gonna say is, it's funny that Berlin advocated for Tokyo. He had like the most conflicts with her yeah, in exactly. the first heist. <laughs> oh, right. Yeah. <laughs> this guy hasn't said anything. <laughs> there we go. Look at them trying to justify it. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Look at these crooks. Tokyo? Tokyo. Oh! We're oh. gonna <laughs> rob Japan too. That's pretty sick. Yeah. Shoot! Oh! Damn it! Oh. Imagine she's. You can get that, but you can't get his aim. head. <laughs> like, come on. Good aim, dude. They practice, remember? But they couldn't get good use head. Are they going to start feuding? Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Nice, nice. Keep fighting. Keep fighting. Hola, Gandía. ¿Cómo estás, cariño? Te a tu casa y mirar a los ojos a tu mujer y a tu hijo Juanito. Cállate, ratita, que voy a entrar y te voy a lavar la boca. <risa> Los llamaste, ¿verdad? He ejecutado a una mujer indefensa. Y luego me he vendido y he traicionado a mi bando por cobarde. Candida. Tranquilo. Hola, Juan. ¿Por qué? Okay. ¿Por qué? 
even then was like maybe chill. Yeah. <laughs> He's gonna blow it up. Oh, precision. Oh my oh. god. What? Oh! <laughs> oh no! Oh, he's dead. No. Oh, that is, that's dead. Two people dead. Oh! oh that guy's done. Oh my god, that was crazy. Gandia! You done fucked up. Did it mess up their vision? Oh, oh did you see that? Oh, it's in his. The shrapnel. Oh, Gandia is such a moron. Oh, damn. Yeah, he's not coming back. Oh, dang. Shoot him? Hey, who shot? Oh, Manila shot. <laughs> His best. Congrats. <laughs> oh. The real questions on the table. Guys, what do you Wait doing? a minute. Aren't they? Al próximo desacato te pongo de rodillas y de vento un tiro en la nuca. Que yo sé quién tú eres, es un celo que Why are you doing this right now? Yeah, what? You're gonna die. El típico disco de gol español, ¿me entiendes? Pero que yo bailar, he bailado muchísimo con esto golvo. Hasta hacer una cámara con azar de bailar. Qué no fault. En todo ese tiempo. No has dudado nunca. It's no to have doubts. Yeah, yes. No, if you never had doubts, then something's wrong. Doubt is completely normal. Oh, live many lives? Have many faces. Oh no, dude. Twenty. Oh, she likes that. Are you? No lo haces porque ahí fuera ya no te está esperando nada ni nadie. No lo haces porque tu vida terminó. Damn. He gave her family. Family. No crees que a él le hubiera gustado que volvieras a ser feliz. Oh, he knows. Oh well, yeah, he does it. He did his research. Oh, he, Ooh, got, he got it. it. Wait, wait, how much did it break? It did look small. Yeah, it did. What? Honestly, Hilti. yo, show sponsored by Hilti. Let's go. I don't know what that is, but they make good ass tools, better than the Walter Bosch. Okay, Mister Construction Guy. <laughs> <laughs> What is that? Uh, construction cartoon? Bob, Bob the Builder? Bob. <laughs> <laughs> Kyle is Bob. Well, these two look like high schoolers. Right? They're too cute. Oh, he's an astronomer. <laughs> Let's see his rock collection. <laughs> so you're gonna get with me. That's your future. Parece que vas a conocer a un chico. Jeez. Solo vamos a tener que mirar en la angulación de Andrómeda. I know. Pero me dice que lo vas a conocer bailando. Dude, he's got the moves. Yes, he's playing the moves on here. Wait. Bro, there's air. There's an air bubble. That was morphine, right? Bro, she didn't. She didn't get rid of the air. There's I know what oxygen. you're saying. I know what you're saying. But is that an error? Like in the filmmaking? Or is this like yeah, is that intentional or not? I'm not sure. <laughs> <laughs> nothing. You're nothing to worry about. <laughs> are, are we gonna clap? Like <laughs> Congratulations. Oh. La alegría no abunda mucho por aquí últimamente. <laughs> Is this really the time for this? Bruh. Finalizado. 
Danica. I like that. There you go. Danica. He is the baby daddy. Dude. Yo, it's him. <laughs> Nah, Danica's with her. Danica, Danica. Oh, Victoria. That's not that. Victory. Okay, she's part of the group. Now it's official. That's okay. Is she okay? <laughs> she is conflicted. What's wrong? No, there's something wrong. I still think she has a bullet in the chamber. Yeah. The gun she has. Why would she turn on them though? They, they've helped her deliver her child and all that. What if the drill just pokes her? Yeah, like, right into her ear. <laughs> Yo, back away from the wall. This reminds me of that friend scene. Get away! Are those holes big enough to shoot through? Of course. Oh! 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 So no, precision. in her legs, in her legs, in her legs. Wait, wait, wait! No, that's her vest. That's your no, arm! No, 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 she's done. Down, down, get down! Wait, what? Wait, what? I was I was social so 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 survive. Five bullets. And it says the day she, she killed Gandia. Yeah. So she does kill him. So, but that's not gonna be spoilers, bro. <laughs> Boys, <laughs> para darle una alegría. <laughs> yeah. Oh, that's cool. Bancos. Llevamos 15, damn. High risk, high reward. What's Sierra doing? Tú no entras. Well, yeah, he's injured, so. But he is the cycle. They need him. Oh, no, she Wasn't really, the morphine for Helsinki? Now she's really gonna start hallucinating. The morphine was for Helsinki. If she gets him killed. Oh, does it like a dumb waiter? <laughs> Fucking Arturo. <laughs> Everywhere. <laughs> How did they not think of that? Oh, she's high as hell saying that. She's still... <laughs> like, what? She needs to get. I guess. I guess yeah. you, ha you have to be high to notice a small to, detail to get creative. <laughs> there it is. Get Tokyo in there first. What He's level like, is the oh. thing on? Well, how is Tokyo again? Oh, you have to call the dumb waiter up. Now nah, like go. A you gotta go down. <laughs> there's, there's, there's rope and stuff. Just hold on. Nah, B, you can't do it with one hand. Tie rope around her waist and start lowering her down. <laughs> Come on. Ah. Oh, damn. Question is, is there anything down there to like break the fall? Well, what if you don't find anything? What if you find like cash? <laughs> there's no cash. Hey, only, cash. Gold. only gold. Yeah, there's only Yo. gold. There's no cash here. Your savior. We are gonna save. Explosion time. Yeah, this is. Yeah. Is there a good spot? Open the thing. Oh shit. What? No, there's no time. <laughs> Stop smiling. <laughs> the old Tokyo here. Kill one person. Kill at least one of them. She says she killed Gandia on her narration. Yes, yes. Yes! Oh! Well, she got the big guy. Oh! Damn it! His bald head, bro. <laughs> it's too smooth, it just deflects it. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, here we go. Oh! Wait! Oh! Shit! She's okay. She's alive. How is she alive? Because oh, why not? Protagonist time. Bandia is a dead man. Tell me she has a grenade on her. 
You're a dead man. She has something. Look at all the grenades on her. Yeah. Grenades? All of them. I told you. <laughs> I told so they're all, dead. they're all dead. They're all dead. Oh yeah. They're all dead. She's dead. <laughs> no! <laughs> oh my god. Damn. Wait, Rio is under, dude. That was a good three, four grenades. Oh my god. Damn, bro. She went out in style, though. She How did. many were in there? Bang. Wow, he lost his first recruit, man. It wasn't just someone on the team. It was the first recruit. How dare you? Make us wait. How the months. hell are you going to kill Tokyo and just end the episode? Like, it was no big deal. Okay, wait, wait. All right, guys, that was our reaction for Money Heist Part 5, Episode 5. If there was any part of the episode we weren't able to put into a YouTube edit, get that in our full reaction over on Patreon. Link is down below. And let's discuss now. Live many lives. Which was more for real, I guess, at the end. That's what she told him. We can kind of tell that this was her end from the in last Denver, in Denver. episode in this one. It was... Her flashbacks. Wait, her flashbacks started from the first episode. Yeah. Right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. So. Yeah, I, I guess it's kind of mixed in, yeah. but it really, uh, like went overboard in this episode with it. Oh, for sure. From so, the start. Yeah. I didn't think she would die, but I thought she would get like severely, like, like Helsinki. Like incapacitated. Yeah. yeah. Helsinki. Helsinki. <laughs> oh wait, did we get that for Nairobi when she died? We did. Yeah, she flashback. Got, she definitely got her kid. kid. Maybe. So now every time they give us flashbacks about someone, they're about to die. Honestly, I don't like that because it feels very Walking Dead. Oh, really? And Walking Dead is not good at storytelling. Like, <laughs> like sorry, sorry, not sorry, but That's they are they are good at prisons. <laughs> That's the whole point of a show. I mean, because like you could tell right, like Walking Dead. You can tell right away when someone's gonna die. Because well, yeah. the, the, like the, the problem the, about the problem with Walking Dead is like there's like 20, 30 characters. Mm. So there's no time to like focus on one for a story, right? Yeah. And the minute they do, then it's like, oh fuck, they're dying. And then they do die. And then it's like, what the fuck? Is it like a zombie thing? It's a yeah. zombie show, yeah. Uh, yeah, so people are always dying too. It's like, oh, I haven't had this much focus on this person. Wow, yeah. so much exposition. <laughs> like, oh, why are we learning about their family? Yeah, exactly. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> But uh, regardless, I still think it was done well in this show. But I could use a little less flashbacks if they like the next five episodes. Or it's more Berlin flashbacks. If they're gonna kill someone, we don't need forty flashbacks in that episode, you know? Yeah, I'm starting to doubt if Berlin's son is even gonna make an appearance this heist. Cause I'm, I'm, I fail to see the connection as yet. Well, we have five more episodes. Yeah, so yeah. maybe he'll be maybe he's part of the end or or he's dead. Maybe he's in charge of the next heist. Who knows? There's no next heist. This is the last season. Well, maybe he'll lead their but kids no, into freedom. Knowing Netflix, they'll do they'll do like a spinoff with yeah. uh, Raphael. Yeah, exactly <laughs> in his <laughs> friends. <laughs> Doing his own thing. But um, I guess we talk about Tokyo right away. We'll talk about the other stuff after, but Tokyo is the main focus here. Yeah. My issue right now, mm. if she's dead, how is she narrating? Yeah. That's, uh, I mean, she is dead. That's for certain. There's, it's impossible. It's impossible. It is impossible. For her Four to grenades. That. Yeah. At least. <laughs> on her chest? Come on. <laughs> and like 40 bullet wounds. <laughs> Just, yeah, exactly. She's Wait, how bullets. do uh, grenades work? Like, uh. If a grenade explodes beside another grenade, is the second grenade gonna blow up? Yes. So, because Gandia also had grenades on him, mm. are those grenades also gonna blow up? I think so. If it's close enough, it should. I'm not sure how it works, but. Whatever is make like, obviously the grenade has the capacity to explode given the yeah. right circumstances. So, I'm assuming immense heat and pressure would be enough to, to attain those circumstances, but I'm not exactly sure, honestly. Yeah, I'm not but... sure, but if that's the case. There's way, there's a good 10, 20 grenades. Like the room. shock and like the shrapnel. 
it that goes puncture puncture it, right? He's at least deaf, blind, probably had a lung Ooh. collapse. He, he, oh, I'm talking about his grenades. His grenades. Did his grenades blow up? Bro, Gandia's dead. Yeah. But he's deaf. Yeah, he has to be dead. Cause no, I just want to get a, a count of like how many grenades blew up. At was least it, four. Maybe five. The or ones six. on her chest for sure. Yeah. And if grenades cause other grenades to blow up, then maybe his grenades too. And all the other people who had grenades on them. Oh god. Yeah, the super chain reaction. I feel like that many grenades, up. it would collapse the whole floor. And Rio would have been fucked too. Yeah. Right? Uh, but it was a pretty thick scene. Like you saw how hard he was. The grenades blow up. I it's, guess. No, but there was a hole already. There was in a there. hole. Okay, there was right a hole, yeah. That. But the hole. Mm, no, the, just because you have a hole doesn't mean it I destroys guess. the infrastructure. You would need yeah. multiple holes. Yeah, exactly. Like a line. Like yeah. what we're doing, like what, how they broke into the, the, uh, the, what was yeah, it yeah. the yeah, frozen the, area. Yeah. yeah. Like that's, yeah, exactly, yeah, exactly how you do it. You multiple points of pressure, then, yeah. yeah. That's how they break like massive rocks too, like right. quarries and stuff. That's what dynamite's for, right? Dynamite's mm -hmm. a cylinder. You drill a hole, put the dynamite in, light that's it. That's what they did in our prison break. With yeah. like the devil horns, season one. Oh. You guys remember that? Yeah, yeah, I remember that. <laughs> Oh my god. <laughs> With light? Oh yeah. man. So, yeah, so my, my problem is still the fact that she's narrating. And we got the line in this episode. It's like, uh, when I killed Gandhi or something, something. Yeah. So it's like, who's... Five or holes. just waiting for him to die. Yeah, yeah. That kind of spoiled it, but... <laughs> <laughs> it definitely spoiled it. We're like, wait, 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 what? But killed Gandia. who's talking then? Like, it doesn't make sense to me. It, no, it, she's I, talking from heaven. She no, but how do you know? not going to heaven. Like, she just became an uh, an omnipresent uh, narrator. Or, 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 or. I don't know if you guys remember. I think this was the last season. Oh no, it's all a dream. No, uh, or the season before, where everyone was just sitting at like a it's like a Dominic Toretto barbecue. Okay. And they're just having yeah. a feast, right? Yeah. And all the dead people are there too. Like Nairobi was there. That's true. Oslo was there. Yeah. Moscow was there. Right. What if that's like the afterlife? Yeah. And that's where she's narrating from. Yeah. I literally just said from heaven. That's not heaven. That's for heaven. <laughs> that's With everyone you. else? Yeah. Crooks don't get I to go to heaven. Yeah, I just assumed it was during the, like, before the first heist. Just talking as if he believes in heaven. <laughs> I don't, but in this you, you can't say show. that. <laughs> you know heaven I mean? is more plausible than what we're experiencing right now. We're saying there. I'm saying, saying there. Heaven is with everyone else. Dude, a Dominic Toretto barbecue yeah, wait. is more plausible than heaven. Okay. Yeah. Why the hell would they include that? Why would they just spoil that? What? Like the exposition where Gundia dies. Why the hell would they give us that line? I guess it's to throw us off on Tokyo dying. Is it to prepare because, us? Because no, no, no. Yeah. It's to throw us off because if we hear their narration, then we think that Tokyo's gonna live because she's narrating. And that's exactly what I thought. Yeah. Me so too. I guess it worked. But then I al we also knew that Gandia was gonna die. I was fine with that. I was just waiting for him to die. She killed everyone else in there, right? Yo, imagine. But how many people are left, though? No, that was all of them. Just the no, psycho no. guy outside. This, this one? Is it is it one? Because she shot two people in the leg. No, two people were shot, hundred percent. Yeah, did but the one people. guy was benched. Yeah, one guy was benched. But the big guy was also benched towards the end of it. He, he was out of commission. I'm pretty so sure. No, he got he shot, but guy. he was still in the room. He probably blew up. But uh, he was just a little further back. Gonna, it doesn't really matter because these guys will get in now from that safe thing. Uh, that I think door. only Gandia is gonna die. Huh? Here's why. Because he, he yelled. What, what'd you say? I think only Gandia is gonna die in the room because he he yelled, "Get back." He had his moment, his his redemption from putting the other people in there. I think there was too many nah, grenades in there. There's a lot of grenades in there. Yeah, if let's say they're not really dead, they're messed up right now. They were all surrounding her. Yeah. Just like logically, if the grenades would not explode. That's not a big on it, and then you gotta get on top of it. It's the only oh, way. Yeah. They did that, yeah. Apparently, that's plausible. People were telling us. I guess. Cause this, uh, they said that's the shrapnel that kills. And. uh... Other than the shrapnel, the sound. Yeah, the wave, will, the shock. The, yeah, it's there. gonna throw you off balance. So that's why they go into the fetal position. It makes some sense, I but guess, yeah. in terms of this last scene, if all of, like, if anyone from that room dies, except the big guy who's a little further back, that makes sense? Mm. Like, I expect him to live because he's further back. 
But if the other people, the girl, um, so what's the guy's name? Uh, Sagasta. Yeah, Sagasta. He was there yeah. too. Oh, yeah, he was there. Yeah, they everyone was there. there, except for the guy who was bad. The cycle. Yeah, the cycle. Yeah. Okay. If any of those people live, then I would be like, dude, what the fuck? They were standing beside him. Exactly. Yeah. So let's talk about Monica. What the hell is? Okay, I understand her situation, but what the fuck are you doing? Yeah, she's Monica. That morphine is, was for Helsinki. Yeah, no, Monica's not herself right now. Yeah, yeah no like shit. Yeah. <laughs> she's off the rails. Arturo is fucking. She started everywhere. saying Arturo now. She's hallucinating. She's got something going on. Maybe she has cancer. Who knows? Dude, we can't catch a break from Arturo. He keeps showing up on our screens. He, like, why? Bro, he can literally die and we'll, we, we still won't, won't lose him. He's going to come back. He's, he's like a. He's permanently embedded in He's gonna follow minds. them in that afterlife. It makes sense. Literally. For, it makes sense for Monica, but why do we have to see him? Like, fuck out of here, man. Bro, at the end of the show, it'll be at the barbecue in heaven, and then he'll show up <laughs> and be like, well, he forgot me. I have some pills for you. <laughs> he's he's the chef. He made all the food. Oh, no. It's already been poisoned. Not poisoned. Date raped. That's what he does. It's been compromised. So... I'm gonna be honest. I didn't care for Monica's situation. I'm sure it makes it makes sense for her, but and neither did they either. They don't have I'm time saying. for this. Like Denver and them. Denver's like, come on. But to be you? fair, she did tell them about the dumb waiter. Yeah, she did. She did. She saved Denver she saved and two people, yeah. Manila. And that does make sense because when you're high, you focus on like the small details of things. Yeah, like the like, random, most yeah. random stuff. So it makes perfect sense. <laughs> like, oh, I'm dumb, dumb, dumb waiter. And then there you go. What the fuck? <laughs> I mean, she figured it out. That's what matters. Okay. I think you're high. But there you go. Um, So Monica thing. Helsinki is... We didn't get closure on that. She went to get the morphine and then we never saw him again. He's chilling. He, she, she finished her past job. Yeah, I guess he's good for maybe a couple... Like maybe 20 minutes. Yeah. For the others to show up. So we have that. We got some closure with Rio in Tokyo through the whole. Oh, it's pretty good. I like that. Even though Rio and Tokyo are not my favorite characters. No. Like, not even close, actually. But it was still a good moment. Mm -hmm. And, uh, what else? Is there anything else? Like, before we get to Professor. Arturo is still haunting her no matter what. I'm talking about that. Even I guess we talk about Gandia now. He, ki he got the. Oh, yeah. Other guy killed, disobeyed orders, and his family situation. Tokyo was spitting facts. Yeah, he didn't even call he them. He exposed so, them. Exposed them. Yeah. Uh, like tunnel visioned on getting revenge. Mm. That he didn't. He couldn't even call and say like, you know, because now he's dead. Yeah. So he's an idiot. <laughs> A dead idiot. Yeah. So is that everything? From the bank? Yeah. Yep. Let's talk about Professor now. What's your take on Sierra? I think there's two options here. One is that there's something wrong with her. Like she has some underlying health condition that she's not That's being verbal about. What I think. And that she needs she needs to deal with it or she can't and she's just struggling and she's freaking out. Or she has a plan. And now that People are heading out, that people are getting away, away from the professor. Maybe he's being, like, you know, isolated. Maybe her plan's going to start coming into play here. No, but maybe she's that, waiting. But I don't know. It seems she's very waiting unlikely. for the final... I think that one scene of her emptying the clip was too uh, specific. So she has one in the chamber, which Probably. is for the professor, I think. If she but doesn't why? flip. Why? But, but she's that, exactly, exactly. her. I would hate her so crazy? much if she does that. I mean, she does. She is, she is a psycho. Man. Yeah, she tortures men for a living. But so that's the that's one way it can go. Is she that bad? <laughs> the other way is what you said that she has some kind of issue. Because when she was uh, so like when Tokyo was dying or almost dying, uh, Professor was on the you know his, his headset, mm -hmm. and she was like uh, calling him, you know. And the way she did it, it was like a desperate child in the back. Like, oh, 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 I have to tell you something. Yeah. It was. It, it seemed like that, you know? Yeah. So maybe she is, like, in a situation. Because it didn't seem like, a, oh, I'm going to mm -hmm. kill you. You know what? And maybe if there is something wrong with her, it makes sense about the whole name scene. 
Because she wants to get the baby's name out before she dies. That way they can there's something to call her. Maybe like at least something that she did for the child. It kind of uh, works. I don't even know. Victoria. Is this foreshadowing that they will be victorious at the end? <laughs> if she's part of this team. You know, I, I really, I, I don't the think the show... The professor gave birth to a child. It's a professor's kid. <laughs> the whole father that died thing was all a lie. So, we covered everything, right? I guess we talked predictions now. For volume two. I mean, Tokyo's. I going, mean, what? Curious. If Tokyo is dead, who's gonna narrate now, or is it still gonna be her? And she's narrating from like the barbecue. Maybe. Yeah. Berlin. No. <laughs> I would want Berlin to narrate. He has the perfect voice. Yeah. Even Professor. No, Professor comes in with the plan when they're talking about the plan. Yeah. And he planned the barbecue. I don't know how they're gonna the do baby. it, but the baby when when the baby's older. <laughs> oh, what if that's who who's been narrating this whole? No, it's not. It's not. It's not. <laughs> we know it. Stop. You know it's not. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Uh, well, predictions. Um, we're assuming the the team is dead, most of them. And Maybe. if they're not, then they're they they're heavily injured and need to regroup. Them. I'd say two or three are alive, and even those two or three are gonna be injured. Yeah, everyone's injured. Oh yeah, whoever survived yeah. is injured. That's for certain. Rio is good. Raquel's good. <clears throat> Palermo's good. Palermo's good. Monica's not good. Did we get any tomato this episode? No, right? No, we didn't. Yeah, that's he's interesting. Taking his aspirins. But yeah, uh, Denver's good. Manila's good. Uh, who else is on? Helsinki's not good. No, he's clinging to life. So the people that aren't good are Monica and Helsinki. They're kind of out of it right now. Yeah, Monica is actually a, a big liability. She might life. even OD. You don't even know. Yeah. Bro, and she, yeah, she has no idea what she's doing. Well, since we're talking about that now, I guess we have to cover it. Like yeah, Manila so. and Denver. Yep. So wait, they were childhood friends? They have been, yeah, they have been friends. Like, okay. before when Manila was a guy, they were friends. So, so I was so confused because, like, I was so confused because uh, I thought they were cousins. So I'm like, wait, what the fuck? Nah, they're but family. But they were, they were just, like, family friends. Or yeah. Something. Yeah, yeah, they were friends. Okay, that makes sense. But even then, I didn't care for it because it was just shoehorned during the action, you know? Yeah, because they were boys, but as it turns out, it looks like Manila was in love with Denver. And uh, now she's like, yo, leave your lady, leave your kid. This is where it's at. And he's like, no, actually, I grew up. You know what right. I think? They keep, like, throwing us, like, hints that Monica actually loves Arturo. She shot him, though. No. No, but she had no please, no. I feel like they keep throwing, like, they, they make us traumatized by him. What? In love? No, love. How can you be in love with that piece of shit, bro? Ask Monica, don't ask me. <laughs> you know what? No, no, no. I think... Arturo made a pretty good case. No, I think when ago. everything Denver has had to say about Monica when he calls her out, I think it's true. I don't remember. Yeah. I don't know. <laughs> I think it is. I that, so hard for me to That means believe. that Den Denver can't record what, then. We gotta take it what... Like, what's her name? It's Stockholm. That literally means... Like yeah. no, I want to get the actual definition, the full definition. Oh, it's Stockholm. We know what it's yeah. No, but I want to know if it's like a temporary thing. It is until you're. Out yeah, it has to be temporary, right? Yeah. Stockholm syndrome. Because she was. Oh. Because they they went to that. Where did they go? Thailand. It Indonesia, doesn't. I think it Indonesia. just says. Yeah, it doesn't say anything about time. Like if it's uh. No, it's not time. It's just when you get out. Well, it doesn't say anything about like the feelings being uh, like short term or something. Mm -hmm. But I think it is because, you know. But he said that he's still in love with her, so. Well, that's Denver. I'm talking about Monica. Yeah, I know, but. The Stockholm is for Monica, not for Denver. <laughs> Wait a second. What? Cincinnati is not Denver's kid. 
No. Yeah, that too. It's Arturo's kid. That is. That's what I'm saying. There's so many hints. It's like things that make it seem that it's not going to work out for Denver. You know? Yeah. I think Maybe she's like... Things are not on Denver's side here. They're on, they're on Monica and Cincinnati's and Arturo's. Yeah, maybe she doesn't have to go to Arturo, but I don't think she's going to end up with Denver. Yeah, th there's a Venn diagram here, and then and she also, falls in the middle. And also, on Arturo's, side. Arturo's death isn't confirmed yet. Because Tamayo wanted to fake it, right? Or not fake it, but like ate it along. <laughs> but we didn't see it happen. So yeah, technically, like Arturo's still alive. He refuses to play in his life support. <laughs> Just 30 more seconds. Come on. Fuck. Well, now he has to save him. Who? Tamayo. Tamayo. Yeah. He has Arturo? to save Arturo. He has to do everything right yeah. now. Yeah. He's got yeah. no chances. He better save him. All right. All right, guys. That was our reaction for Money Heist Part 5, Episode 5. If you enjoyed the video, make sure to like, comment down below your thoughts and predictions for Volume 2. We want to know what you guys think. Also, remember on Patreon, you get the full reactions. Links down below. Help support the channel and make sure you subscribe for when Volume 2 comes out. We will be reacting to that on the channel and see you in our next video. Peace.